me fish back from the dead finally uh, with a long overdue sketchbook tour. I'm already over halfway through my next sketchbook, sketchbook 18, because um, I finished this ages ago and um, I just haven't been able to do this and it's going to have to be in two parts again because yeah, every time I try to make a video that I actually have to edit it goes horribly wrong so <laughs> So let's just do this unedited again. Um, so I've got my goals, which I've decided to start doing now. And um, this is just a redraw of something I did in 2014. And now I've started um, finally being okay with drawing on the other side of the page. Like I'd sort of done that in my previous sketchbook, but it wasn't quite as like confident as drawing something like this on the other side of a page. And I was just testing out if this paper is good with markers. It's a little bit weird with markers, but it it's fine if you kind of roughen up the page. And um, my favourite picture in the whole sketchbook. It's quite early on in the thing. I got a sudden wave of inspiration to draw this, which is quite rare. A Ryan Orange head. An OC couple of things that happened in the dream he came from back in like 2016 and um, Google translated Star Trek lines like when you put something into Google Translate and then just keep translating it and translating it and then back into English yeah <laughs> and more Star Trek stuff because if you hadn't already figured out I like Star Trek and it's now including Enterprise characters because I finally watched it some doodles and off because I'd finally I'd finally watched a let's play of it. Um, something from a dream, something else from a dream, and some more doodles. I've always been I've always wanted to do a spread like this. And uh, yeah, I keep seeing these in other people's sketchbook tours, and I finally did one of my own. Doodles, and a thing from a dream, and a ninja Bart Simpson. More doodles. Um, <laughs> Life is Fun, which is a really awesome song. And something that I've been wanting to draw for ages, a bathroom scene. I've don't ask me why I've been wanting to draw a bathroom scene, because I don't really know. <laughs> and more doodles, but this time they're eyes. Because <laughs> I just woke up one day and just really wanted to draw eyes for some reason. So, pose practices, because I need to do those. And some things inspired by some bad voice recognition. I was watching back one of my old videos with like the auto captions on because then it makes it less painful to watch and it misheard Obera as Sorbara and KK Slider as Cakey Slider. Oh my cat's here. Hi honey. Can you? You're kind of in the way. <laughs> ah, she's fine. Um, background practice from an Animal Crossing background and um crossover picture and um, my attempt at a comic which is more than two panels long <laughs> and this thing and I got this comment on my previous sketchbook tour um, which kind of snapped me out of this weird kind of funk I was in almost like I started to get like be like a major perfectionist when it came to my sketchbooks and I realized that I'd stopped taking the time to just doodle and had to make everything look nice so I'd been trying to doodle more so yeah this guy was from a dream I had in 2014 I asked him where the bathroom was <laughs> and uh when I did those um, Google translated Star Trek lines, one of them became this is an Enterprise Starship Trip, so I just drew this because one of the Enterprise characters is called Trip, so I thought it would be funny. <laughs> so 
sort of reminders for myself. I don't have to colour every, everything in. It's something to do when I'm bored. And something else from a dream. His name was Rodney, her name was Cleothea, and her name was Mandy. And another scene from that dream, the same dream. Some more doodles, nicer doodles, and fan art of um, AJ Crosser, I think his name is, uh, inspired by this weird Tumblr post that I keep seeing everywhere. And I, another thing inspired by the same Tumblr post, but instead it's Trash Dentist and 2.30 from the um, Ghost and Iris collab songs. <laughs> and it's really stupid. Um, the art blob challenge. One of them ended up looking like one of my OCs. Another art blob challenge. This thing, I don't know what this thing is. And uh, an open out page with loads of OC um, profiles on them. Um. <laughs> I don't know if you heard that, but my cat just meowed. So yeah, open out page. Something inspired by Overly Sarcastic Productions, my favourite YouTube channel, and um, my new favourite Greek myth, Theseus and Pirithus. So yeah, it's awesome. And more OC stuff. Some more doodles and another OC profile. This is actually the first profile I did because I stuck the others in later. And this was when I, I felt like something was following me but there was nothing there, but it always felt like there was something behind me, so I just came to the conclusion that it was a ghost following me. And um, a very autumnal fan art spread. <laughs> Got Gravity Falls, um, Night in the Woods, um, Over the Garden Wall, Moomin, Gorillas, Ghost Stuff, Hello Charlotte. <laughs> and, um, fan art Fan, fan art fan collage of Perfect Nothing by Ghost. It had just come out at that point and I was kind of obsessed with it. And here I started doing Drawloween. I didn't want to do Inktober. Uh, I kind of decided to sort of come up with my own prompts. I did Gortober last year but I decided to do something different this time. So these are the first two. Doodle, more art blobs, some more random doodles. The aching ghost is a little ghost waving at you. Something I put on the fridge with magnetic poetry and decided to write it down. I don't think it was me who started it. That was just one that's just been growing for months. <laughs> I don't know. More Drawloween and a, a doodle. More Drawloween, once they're in the closet. I did a digital version of that. It's on my deviant art. Doodle. Sort of. Vent, kind of. I don't know. Um... More Drawloween, random picture, which was somehow inspired by Piper Sweeney, and I have no idea how, but it was. <laughs> and uh, more Drawloween, this time the theme was brainwashing, so I drew Kenneth, one of Ghost's characters, because he brainwashes everyone. And um, he's basically screensaver. And I actually start getting into the habit of doing thumbnails again, which I haven't done since college. <laughs> And uh, so this is the halfway point, so this is probably where I'm going to end the video. This was also Drawloween Circus, so I decided to draw my three main... I have this thing in my OC, it's called the Biddedly Circus, and these are the three main members of it. Kanna, Cody, and Jesse. And then these two are also prominent members, Lavender and Nikolai. So, so yeah, this is where I'm going to end part one. Um, this time I'm going to try and upload part one and part two together so there probably won't be a wait this time so so yeah <laughs>